Today is the 21st of November, 2022. Turn around at the end. Sometimes they leave their spray on. How are you doing, folks? Today is the 21st of November, 2022. I'm trying to show you something here in Tucson, Arizona. We've got our weather controllers doing the full-on spraying of our skies, geoengineering. Because what uh, this is all about is they spray a whole bunch of white powder in our skies and then they tell you it's climate change, okay? That's the way it goes. When in reality, we've got people controlling our weather 100%. And then betting money on it, yeah. They can bet right in your uh, stock market. That is correct. You can bet on the weather. That is correct. So, when you... Oh, this is so bad. Because the problem is, see, when you control the weather, you control the food supply. You control the food supply, you control the planet. That's that simple. Okay, folks? So we need to get this stopped, and then you're going to have no problems with climate change. Okay? That's reality. So here is a prime example. Just a little bit later in the same day. Today is the 21st, November. Okay, when you take a look at this, and I've talked about this many times, this is the Santa Catalina mountain range. And look at the straight lines over top of it. Back and forth, back and forth in the Santa Catalina mountain range. It's insane. And the reason I say it's insane is because there used to be a law here, here in Tucson that didn't allow this because the Santa Catalinas is Mount Lemon. Mount Lemon has a, a community up there, and when an airplane goes flying over, it makes a lot of noise, and it just becomes a problem. So a long time ago, they made a law, told the Air Force Base next to us, Davis Monthan, they cannot fly over the length of the Santa Catalinas. So they made the rule basically that if a commercial air flying, airline is coming over it, they need to pass over it and not stay over top of it so they got to pass it the other way you know so be over with it and done then all of a sudden come chemtrail planes and they don't mention nothing about it but they fly directly over the mountain back and forth i've literally filmed them they go to the end and they uh what do they do they literally turn around at the end sometimes they leave their spray on at the end unbelievable Back and forth, back and forth. It's crazy. So none of those are commercial airplanes. I'll tell you that much. Not a single one of them. Yep. Okay. They're going directly overhead of that thing. Oh yeah. It's called geoengineering. It's weather control. And it also refers to climate change. Because this this is climate change, folks. This here, that's climate change. Spraying of particulates into our sky. And then saying that we have to worry about man-made climate change. A whole bunch of garbage. The reality is, is this is the reality. Spraying over skies and controlling the weather. You know? And why people can't see this is just beyond me.
almost surreal, isn't it? It is for me. Watching this happen day by day, week by week, month after month, year after year. And people still not standing up fighting for their rights and getting this ended. Doing a little sightseeing, but this is getting a little drastic. Wait a minute, what the heck? No way. I'm not gonna. That, that, uh, yeah. I think this is where I turn around. Tucson reporter, Chris Haskell. <laughs>